you do, everybody? Blazers on here. Welcome to another video. Today we're gonna be playing some Bloodborne. Oh yeah, saw this one coming. Had this in my library for a good two months now. Been planning on playing it for a good six or seven. Um, <laughs> reason why I've had it sitting for two months is because I am absolutely terrible at this game since it has no difficulties. You need to be good at these types of games. If you know uh, what kind of game this is, it's kind of like Dark Souls. If you know what Dark Souls is, if you don't know what Dark Souls is, basically, the combat is dodge rolls and hitting when you need to, and if you don't, you s you're pretty much dead. I forgot the controls over the last two months, so this is going to be pretty much a rage montage of me absolutely terrible. I haven't gotten past the first stage, and neither has Logan. We're going to do a co-op playthrough, and you have to actually get about five hours in before you can do a co-op playthrough, but, uh... Yeah, we're doing a new game. I actually gave it a test run a few months back. Oh, yeah. Hell and here's a cutscene. Huh. Well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You need only unravel its mysteries. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of Yarnum blood of your own. First, you'll need a contract. Also, this is a very demented game. It has lots of demons and lots of uh, gory gore. And I actually have... Um, where is it? No! No! Uh, where are my favorite? Load favorite. There it is. Yeah. There is... Ooh, uh, let's go. Oh, that did not go in, but it is... Diblet. Now, a lot of people actually kind of ask why I play females, and, you know, people usually just come with the assumption, he's so freaking like... For girl hungry 12 year old that lives in his basement and you're right about four of those things no uh, I I just like playing female characters because I don't know I mean I wanted to play Dibley but I couldn't make a good-looking one so I just made like a stupid glasses wearing one or wearing character named Diblet <laughs> uh, but yeah I, I really don't know as you see I have no idea what I'm doing uh, <laughs> I should have played this after I test run it Okay, um, so, that's good to go. And we get all that going. Age, mature, aged, and young. No, it actually does nothing. Alright, can I go... I got my eyes closed. I don't want to be aged, please. All right, whatever. Uh, origin. Ordinary happy upbringing, all attributes average. Uh, nah. Lone survivor of lost hamlet, high life essence and vigor. Huh. Highly resilient. See, some of these are actually kind of crazy. Um, waste of skin. You are nothing talentless. You shouldn't have been born. Now, this is pretty... Basically, depending on what uh, way you pick to play the game is your difficulty. If you play Waste of Skin, I am very... I feel very bad for you. And I feel bad for <laughs> the name. This is just mean. Go cool face terrible hardships, but now confident in your purpose. Noble Scion. Scion to a respectable line with faith in your pedigree. I think I'm going to play... Lone Survivor or... That's what I played in my test run, but I mean, a little bit more HP is nothing to cough at. Then I have less blood tinge and arcane, but... And strength. But, yeah, whatever. Let's do it up. Parents, you really... You don't get to change the way, like, your, um... Clothes look, and I wish you could, but all you can change is, like, your appearance and stuff. Voice. I want to hear... I want to hear this. Oh my 
God. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my God. That is just... Take it in the wrong context. I really don't care about this. This is just nasty, dude. Like... Jesus! That scream of agony. I think that's you falling. Oh, young voice. I mean, standard slim, very slim. Should I be, like, really fat? Very burly? Oh, muscular, no. I don't want to be muscular. Very muscular, very burly. It looks more fat. I did. I was gonna do that with the follow playthrough too. I really don't care about standard. Like I, I don't really care about that. Skill adjustment. God, you can just go stupid here. Um, change by ten. Yeah. Oh no. Big ass arms. No, um, I'll do default for this. Oh no, I don't actually want that. Um, I'll just go in between. Because that's what average basically is. And I don't care that much. Because we're basically going to be covered by armor the entire time anyway, so. Yep. Uh, base skin color, we're going to be freaking red. If there's blue, dude, we're gonna be blue because it's gonna match that match the hair color. Holy freaking pale, dude! Freaking blue dog. That's the closest the blue you're gonna get. Oh my god, it's like a vampire. That's freaking crazy. Um, I guess that's okay. Yay! The hair looks really nice in this game, but I don't know. I think it's a funny looking um. glasses I put on there they're like see like you got all normal glasses you got hippie glasses kind of even hippier glasses and you got Harry Potter glasses and you got a monocle okay that's kind of badass but these are funny I think you can actually make them bigger too you can change the color of the lens as well which is kind of cool so you can have very red lenses I'm probably gonna do a very blue because it's, it's a blue person blue it up Pump it up. Yeah, we want really, really blue. Like a turquoise. Does it get any brighter blue than that? I, I think I have to add some green. Sorry, I'm a type of person that actually really likes making characters in games. That's all me, though. Like, at the same time, I really don't care enough to give a crap, but it's always nice. There we go. Super duper, super blue. Like a turquoise show palette. Oh, you can actually pick no. No! Did all our work for nothing. There you go. That's our preset. Why not? Tattoo. Tattoo or mark? What? There's no tat. There's no tattoo. Um, okay. And like, oh man, that one, I was going to do it too. I was going to do it. Ah, uh, oh no. I was going to do a beard. I was going to do a turquoise beard. That would have been so badass. Whatever. I don't care about pupils. All right. Yeah, I guess I think that's okay to go. So pale. Yeah, I gotta change that. There's no, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> you can be a gross, like, red color. Um, where's the gray? It's like, where, there's like a gross red color that you can be. Like, what? You're orange, dude. You don't want to be orange. I guess that's normal enough, right? Face details, I don't think I actually really care about face details as much as I should. Parent age. 
I want to be two. I want. I'm gonna go to two. Yeah. I'm very masculine. I'm a masculine ass two year old. That just looks weird. Never mind. <laughs> Feminine ass two year old. There you go. And I, I don't I don't know what that is. <laughs> and yeah, I'm I'm going too in depth with this. Um alright, that's good to go. Finish. Alright, there's the character built. There's a contract. Blue elixir. Dubious liquid medicine used in strange experience conducted by high minute okay. Cold blood flower by the materials and holy chalice ritual. Uh, yeah, this game is a very difficult game, and Sony, Sony when it ripped off Halo, it had Kill Zone. But then when it ripped off Dark Souls, which wasn't even it was a PlayStation game, like it wasn't PlayStation exclusive, but they nailed it. Oh god, this is this part I don't like. Mike, I had to disconnect. Second. Oh, jeez. Yeah, okay, then the next part comes. Yeah. It's a gruesome ass game. Uh. Then the things come. Oh, God. Get out. <laughs> Get out. Oh, there's like ten of them, dude. Oh, uh. Oh, gosh. Come on, chicks, get out of here. Found a <sighs> um. I gotta do a quick cut, but I'll, I'll see you guys in a sec. Sorry I had to jump. Uh, I just had to go and talk, and I'm gonna be a little bit quiet. Nothing but pity here. Alright, why not? The notes we got. And we got this one here. It is all thanks to the clinic and no mercy for hunting. Alright. No, no, no. Alright. As you see, oh, we really don't have anything. Oh, we have the basic stuff we start with. And yeah, that's it. Um. I remember the basic controls, also I refresh myself. Oh, I forgot about that. Um Remember the combat. It's pretty fluid.
this first fight, dude. First enemy you fight is unbeatable. Okay, it is. You can actually beat it, but it is extremely, extremely, extremely hard to do. Um, you do this part of the weapon, or the weapon, the game. We actually go and get some crap. <coughs> uh, so I might as well explain what I did today. Um, I went to school and did crap, and uh, got home. Well, I didn't actually even get home. Went to some band thing, and uh, I went and bought. Some, like, nice shirts and stuff. Or not nice shirts, but a light, nice shirt and a tie and all this stuff. You know, so I can look presentable because my teacher's a dick. And this kid shows up, right? He has this freaking, like, Chevrolet t-shirt inside out. That's what he's wearing. And some black pants and some freaking, like, Nike shoes. Like, what? Really? Like, are you, are you kidding right now? I don't know, that's just retarded, dude, like, <laughs> legit. Uh, well, uh, the cane is what I used last time. The cane was pretty cool, but it it didn't deal with the damage, and it didn't have enough uh, attacks. So I think I'm going to go with the axe. And the firearms. Um, I'm probably going to go with the blunderbuss. Um, but like I was saying, um... <laughs> yeah, it was all presentable and crap, and I got pissed off when I got there, and he basically, um, didn't care. He shrugged off that kid, but, you know, I answer, I gotta go uh, left hand, but still, it's just retarded, dude, <laughs> like, god, I hate that so much. Uh, so here we are at the churchy place, uh, basically all we need to do is teleport. Also, after that, I walked over to my pops. <coughs> we uh, filled out the bracket. Well, that was before uh, for my NCA bracket, and then uh, we went out to eat. That was real nice. Then uh, I went home, or I went to my uncle's. He said he'd pay me if I uh, helped him clean out his kitchen. He's trying to redo his house and crap. But dude, was that freaking scary? I I wasn't really happy doing that. I know we can kick this kid's ass. At least. My blood echoes. Echoes? You thought I was lying when you needed weapons to fight this dude? Like you kick some booty. When you finally get your weapons. In fact, I shouldn't have used that much ammunition there, though. I really shouldn't have. Um, bullets you don't really get. You can actually sacrifice some of your HP to get bullets, but you don't... I can't exactly remember what button is, but I don't really want to try it. Alright. So I have the basic basis of what I'm supposed to do here. Spooky ass friggin' graveyard. <coughs> and you basically just want to go and get crap done. The game from here slings you like out into nowhere. It basically says, alright, have fun. There's no storyline. You figure out what to do, dude. Alright, I need to freaking lock on first. Freaking hell. Damn, dude. Alright, that was bad on my part. That was extremely bad on my part. <laughs> that was so bad. I'm sorry, I was distracted because my dogs are barking in the background, and it is like. What? Almost time to go to sleep. 
It's like 10.45. Alright, let's get her done, shall we? That was my fault. I didn't lock onto him and fought him. Or fought him. Uh, fight him like I should have. Alright, we got some looty loots here. Some, oh, 10 more bullets. Yeah, yeah, I'll take that. Hopefully you guys can't hear the dogs. I am truly sorry if you can, because that's exa not exactly something I don't think you want to hear, though. And I guess that's all we are getting, then, is loots. We're at 16 ammunition for our blunderbuss. Alright. Round two, pal. Had me die? There we go. Got my echoes back. That's good. That's basically the currency in this game. Yeah, there's nothing for me to search on him. Sure, dog. Ah, dang. Oh, God, I forgot to lock on again. There we go. He's done. I usually do heavy attacks just because they're a little bit more usable or user-friendly to me. Just because I know I'm going to do tons of damage. Oh yeah, and those blood vials? We're not going to have many of those, so get used to that, guys. There's that. And there should be a lever around here. I forgot. Uh, I know there's destructible environments, I just don't exactly remember what you can break. Alright. It's a lever. Alright, well, let me do something first. I don't think we can open up this. Yeah. <coughs> I'm pretty sure. All there is is a little bit of loot here. Sorry, I had to cut again. Alright, but like I was saying... Yeah, alright, there is nothing. We're at 9 blood vials and 12 ammunition. That is a sight I've never seen before. <laughs> Actually having more than 5 blood vials. Alright, yeah, we can't go past there. So I guess let's, I guess, go up the ladder then. Alrighty. Now this game I'm not going to upload too often, so hopefully you guys understand that. But uh, this game's more of a game I'm going to play when I feel like it. It's just when I'm in the Dark Souls feel. And Dark Souls 3, I'm at... At least this game just has some spooky ass stuff. And here we are. Time for blood. Let's light up that lamp so we can uh, spawn back here later. Yep, I know exactly what it does. And right here is going to be a dip short. There you are. And he done. Alright. There's going to be a few more guys around this way. So I do remember, since I never actually made it past pretty much the tutorial section. The shield guy. And he done. <laughs> Alright. Do you have anything for me to loot, pal? Nope. Alright. Yeah, this part I don't exactly like. There's just a whole horde of guys down there. There's a bunch of... There's four down there. There's like 50 or 60 on that side. And there's a boss back there. So basically we have like 20 enemies to take out. Basically. Let's take out one guy at a time if we can. Mr. Pick, pitchfork here. Ooh. He almost got me, boys. Just push his corpse down the staircase. As you see, there's a ton of guys over here. And if we can draw one at a time with us, just the way we want to do it. It's a 
it's night, you don't want to be out when the these guys are out at night. Ah, oh, that was a bad, bad idea. Now we have like seven guys on our six. All right. You wanna go, kid? You wanna go, kid? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, get fucking wrecked. Okay, what do you got for me? One more blow vial. It's gonna be a gunner right around this corner, as far as I remember. Yeah, there is. All right, there's like a musketeer right around this corner. So what I need to do is heavy attack on Ah, oh, frick. Oh, no. Now I'm in a whole world of hurt. I don't even remember what's up here. That's like funnel attack. Oh, this stupid musketeer kid. Ah, oh, I forgot how I used the blood vial, dude. Oh, crap, um... Uh, um, I, I didn't know my axe did cool stuff like that. <sighs> Sweet. Yeah, okay. Um, square no, circle no, X. Oh, okay, it is triangle. All right. Um, I didn't know the axe got big. So I, I, I go heavy attacks all the way. There we go. Cursed beast. I ain't no cursed beast. There we go. Now we're at full HP. Now if you... <laughs> I was lying. There's legitimately about 25 guys here. A lot of them riflemen. And yeah. They killed a beast. And basically... Uh, this is one of the most impossible parts of the game. You need to funnel them. I can understand how that works. Oh crap, he's, he's rushing me, dude. There's one behind me too. Uh oh. I don't know how that works, but yeah, I'll go with it. Super attack. Foul beast. Am I saying that or is? You, dude. Those hurt. All right. We're sitting prim and proper right now. Now I'll show you guys where the first boss you can fight is. <coughs> or without fighting anybody. There's a fat ass way in the back. You can see him right around the corner, and he is huge. Oh, he's coming my way. Yeah, I want to get out of here. I don't like fighting that guy. I've tried doing it before and it just does not work out. You need to be pretty good at this game to do that. So it looks like there's a good 10 left. Uh, shoot you. Yeah, try taking a shot, dude. I dare you. Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought. You can only dodge so many times before your energy runs out, so. Musketeers, um, there's only a few guys left. Yeah, come on, shoot me, dude. That's how you cripple on the head. <laughs> Fuck, those shots really do hurt. I hit you and you're fired. No, I can't die right now. That is a really, really bad idea. 
because then we have to fight every single guy again. Whew, that was a close one. All right, um, there's that musket yeah, right there. Right around the corner. We're gonna wanna try to emphasize on killing him. Best way to do that would be like a super, uh, to get everybody marked. Fuck this guy. No, 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 no. I told you these musketeers, dude. They are just absolute aids. Alright, that's good. That's good. Hey, you. I'm not done with you yet. Dang, dude. Stop shooting me. I would shoot you, but I don't have, like, any good am or any, like, range attacks. I want to get all this loot here. He's not dead yet? What? There you go. Light attack for the win. Alright. There is tons of good loot over there. Um, and by good loot, you see the glowing corpses? That is all lootable bodies. Oh, dude, the musketeer got down. Alright, good. Guess these are lootable then. Yeah, shoot the totem, dude. I dare you. There we go. Oh, no, he didn't get down. He just fell down. Oh, what the hell is this thing? Die right now, die right now. Fuck, that thing is scary. I feel bad for it. There we go. He's taken care of. And what is this? Oh, no. I'm gonna pick up the loot. Dude, you're the one attacking me, okay? So shh. The door. As soon as I pick up whatever this is, it's gonna break out. Just need to pick up the rest of this little looty loots. I think that we've already found all the bodies, so. And we've killed everybody here. So that's all good in the hood. Here's another body. Cold blood dew. Don't know what that is, but um, I'd like to. Now, there's multiple bosses and multiple ways to go. Um, I've already experienced one of them. Look at that big dude. Let's see what this guy does. Oh no, let's keep on seeing what this uh, specter is going to do. Now, I don't know if we go heavy or light throughout this fight. <coughs> we have tons of currency. I don't like these noises. Well, I guess it's better safe than safe. Holy hell. Dude, all I need to do is get off a light attack. Oh, yeah. I wrecked this kid. Ah, oh, fuck. Up, dude! I just absolutely destroyed this boss. Ah, oh, nice, good one, guys. Molotovs, the torch. Uh, torch is gonna be nice. You can light people aflame. 
Because I am going to hold on to the uh, gun I have currently instead of equipping the tur the torch, the torch. That was pretty nice. Yeah, I don't. Oh, what the fuck are you? What the hell are you? I, I don't even want to know. They're not following me, are they? Are they? Something scared me. I didn't expect, like, zombie crows. Jeez. I'm not gonna try to take him out the only way I know how. That's with guns and hammer. Yes. There. You spooked me once already. It's going to kill me. I'm going to just quick. <laughs> Stupid as I am, I actually pressed the wrong button. Yeah, I pressed the wrong button. I want to make sure. <coughs> the sound effects and the voice and music are up. Even if they are demented as hell. Oil urn. Nice. I'm just coated with a nice shade of blood. Oh my god, our character's face just absolutely blood delicious. Fucking hell. Keep on saying hidden path, but oh, right there. But all they said was dogs. It looks like it too. I think I'm gonna avoid that and then check a different way. This dog. Um, no, actually, let's fight up some dogs. They got it. I didn't think they could. Poor oh, These guys hit hard. Mongrel. Die! I feel that so bad for you guys. You're like all gross and infected. Oh, there's a cage of three down here. I'll get you out of here. I've never actually been this far, so <coughs> I don't really know exactly what lays ahead. You know shit about me, dude. I, I actually don't know shit about me. To be honest. <laughs> Is 
Let's see what these notes say. Remember hidden path. No other notes? No other notes. I don't even know what this is. What is this thing? Whoa, 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 whoa. Keep going crazy there, dog. Take another. And we made our HP back, so that's okay. There's another one of those things. I don't think that's the only one. Oh, they make fucking cl clicker noises, dude. Oh my god. I don't want to do this. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> right, we just need to sneak up all nice and slow. Just fine. Just... Fine! Yeah. That's not the only one, that's not the only one. Oh no, Musketeer. Expecting that, were you? Hmm. Oh, there's another one of those weird guys over there. All right. What about you? All right. Sounds good, I guess. So far, at least. I'm so surprised they haven't died yet, though. Like, other than the, our initial death. Let's try the same strat we did last time, though. There we go. It all worked out in the end. I really, like, I really like the fact that you can extendo your axe. That's pretty freaking sweet. You could do that with the cane. You could make it into a uh, like chain, and then back into like a solid cane. But I thought that was like cane specific. But all right, 14 vials, dude. I'm really kicking it. <sighs> Secret path, my ass. It just doesn't. Oh, there's like 30 guys here. I guess it is more convincing than this, but I can fight a few musketeers. <laughs> Never mind. That is so loud. Do you even want to be down here? I probably don't. I'll go and fight these guys first. Look how bloody and gory I am, dude. Unless that's just the rain and the blood combined, but... Sorry, pal. End of the line for you. <laughs> no, nah, maybe even me. Oh, uh, yeah? You're a play dude? You your freaking super combo don't work? Oh, they might. Three vials on that guy, though. Bloodstone shard. No idea. Are oh, you a little dick? What's that for? 
I got killed. Bullets. Most catchers always have bullets now. It's a new infectoid. Hopefully, this secret way was worth it because I really have no idea where I'm going or what I'm doing. On this side of the like pier or like water area, it's not really anything, but we'll go investigate anyways. <coughs> I see some more loot over here on the first mist here. Some more bullets, all right. Well then, we might as well get her done. This guy's going up and I'm going down. Note, beware of sniping. <laughs> I like it. Well, I already sniped them, so. Alright, there's somewhere to go from here. There yeah, better not be no shit going on down here. I don't want to be freaking fighting in the sewers or whatever. What is that? What is that? doesn't know. Turn back. Well, he said turn back. Fortunately, I'm not that easy to please. Fear ambush. Beware of trap. I'll go up then. We're going up. <laughs> I was trying to do like an action shot from behind, but. I have no idea where I'm going, guys. I, I just need to find another lamp, really, is the best. Ah, another fatty, alright. Yeah, then. Madman's knowledge. Skull of enlightenment used to gain insight. No mercy for birds. Heck yeah, dude. Alright. Alright, so I think this is gonna be the last cut before the end, but we still gotta kill this big ass boss. Last time what we did was use the combo. What's the note say? Time for sneak attacks. Alright. That's what we did last time. I don't know if that's gonna work. Hopefully it does. Worked. Dundee. What about here? Let's find food. 
stretch you out, Sandra. Trying to fool me to open this door. Heaven forbid that it's depravity. I'll read the notes. Reeks of woman. <laughs> uh, I'm not even just gonna. I'm not gonna comment on that. What about you? Yeah, sneak attacks, dude. This guy knows what he's doing. All these guys do. I think that's as far as we're gonna get, to be honest. Um, so I think next episode we're gonna take a look at that sneak attack. It's the only thing is though is I really need to find another lamp. Uh, lamps are the way to save in this game, and without them you're kind of screwed. And I really don't know where any other ones are. You see all these crow fucks and stuff, but um. I don't know. We did all this work. I, I might as well go until we get to the next lamp. Uh, but I'm just scared on uh, how this is going to work out. So everybody says it's a trap. I'm probably going to believe them. And let's go. Vile beast. I'll put that here separately, I guess. No, there's more? There's a fucking pen. Come on. Fucking hell. Stop game. Stop game. I know you have your fun, but. God, you can't do this to me. Time for rolling? I guess let's try taking him. Time for rolling. Don't be fooled. Don't be fooled. <sighs> it explains itself. Just watch the specter again, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, still don't have a lamp. It's worrying. Is it a lamp all the way over there? Could it be? Is that a lamp on the wall? That easy, can it? Oh, Just oh crap! I didn't know you were actually. Uh... These guys are pretty slim. They're just tough. That's all it is. Alright. Remember night. There's like a ton of you over here. I mean, I don't know what my reward is for killing all of you, but I might as well give it a try. I have enough vials to conquer it, so. 
Take you one at a time. Game still likes flipping me off. And it knows it can't. It's not that boar thing way at the end of this thing. Alright, let's go. Another story about uh, <coughs> today. I don't know why I just wanted to play Bloodborne now. It's just like, dude, I think I can finally do it. I want to read the notes. Don't be fooled. That one guy was fooled. You know, let's watch it one more time for comedic effect. Oh, it's gone. Uh-oh. Yeah. Is there a lamp at the end? That's one big ass pig, dude. Come on, game. You gotta give me a chance, please. God, this episode's gonna be so long, but I mean, I've made so much progress. It's not even funny anymore. There's like five people over there. Don't see a lamp. Um. Altar of some sort. Um, remember fire. Here, beast. No. Game, you've deceived me too many times. Alright, I guess it's time to take you guys out then. beginning hello good hunter I am a doll here in this dream to look after you honorable hunter pursue the echoes of blood and I will channel them into your strength you will hunt beasts, and I will be here for you to embolden your sickly spirit. Very well. Let the echoes become your strength. Let me stand close. Now shut your eyes.
good hunter. Oh my god, all that fucking wait, central yard can I go there? So if I did all that, dude, then I'm gonna ask to rush back rifle spear, a trick weapon crafted. Uh, the powder keg, the prototype weapon serving as a simple firearm and spear, possibly good in an imitation of the lost. God. Yep, all that progress has been wasted. All the beautiful, beautiful progress. All the freaking entire time we've been playing. Uh, do we have to fight everybody again? Yep, we do. Uh, now, now you see. My Bloodborne is not the easiest game. Because it's controlled by lamps. That you never get. Ugh, alright, well... I'm going to call it quits for this episode. I'm going to try to get back to where we were, but that, that was just absolute terribly, terribly, absolutely terrible. God, we got so damn far and everything. Um, I loved playing this game uh, for these the, for about this hour and playing, and I've been doing really good, so it's just the fact that I absolutely got destroyed afterward, um, and that pisses me off. Let's go back to this lamp, see if there's like a note that tells us where the next lamp is. Hmm. Well, there went that, I guess. Well, thank you guys for watching. I had a lot of fun playing this session, and next session we'll come back, and we'll uh, I'll try to get to back where, as far as we were, but I'm going to be honest, that was a good uh, half hour we spent getting farther. Um, here, let's take a look at random cut. Random cut. All right. Um, there's Diblet right there. And... Well, wait. And there's our character, super bloody and beaten. Uh, we used to be just absolutely smothered in blood, though. And it was amazing. Um, but hopefully this was kind of a test run. And to tell you guys how hard this game is, the fact that we lost all the progress we just worked on for the last half hour, it's kind of annoying. I like this axe, though. It's a really cool weapon. And I think that's going to be our main weapon for a bit. Uh, the blunderbuss, on the other hand, I don't really use. But I guess it can just be a ranged option to stagger because we're at uh, 28 bullets, but hopefully you enjoyed. I love playing this game, and I will see you guys in the next Bloodborne session. Hi to everyone. Never mind, I hate ripping off YouTubers. Peace out, everyone.